This video is brought to you by Card Empire. If you're looking for Yu-Gi-Oh, Pokemon, or Magic of the Gathering, this is the place to be. Oh, what's up, people? Dobbs Wars is right here, and welcome to what month is it now? It is. It is August. Holy goodness! Oh, mother of goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Welcome everybody to another lot of pack openings of this month. Before we start, as always, please check out Card Empire, the place to be in Manchester, Stockport and Liverpool. And today, something a little small, but something I've been wanting for a long time. Because if this got released when it was the time of Hidden Arsenal, if you guys remember the set Hidden Arsenal, this deck would have been an absolute demolish of the game. Everybody would have been using this deck since the very beginning. However, there was a massive card that came out for this for this deck and it got instantly banned because it was that damn strong. And this is the structure deck, Freezing Chains. I love this set, I love this deck. It looks awesome, I've saw the trailers, I've seen everything about it. It looks like an absolute unbeatable deck if you have a set of three. So I'm looking forward to it. As you guys know, it's a standard nice little box. We'll put that to the side anyhow. Let's have a look at the play map really quick, as we always do. So as you guys hear, so it looks like the sets that you need to use to make this deck stronger, you need Blazing Vortex, Phantom Rage, Legendary Duelist, The Rage of Ra, and of course, the Rise of the Duelist. But also, you have yourself the beautiful paper play mat, which actually does look awesome. I wish it was an actual matted play mat. Very beautiful. We'll put that to the side. Now, let's have a look at this. So, right from the start, we have the revealer of the ice barrier. So, definitely the ice barriers, as you guys know. Ice barriers were quite a massive thing back in the day. And I think they still are quite strong to this day right now, but I don't think a lot of people use them. But probably the game has changed now that this deck is now released. Because if I remember, a card that a lot of you may not remember, Trishula, it is finally out of the ban list. So yeah, it's going to be an absolute insane monster to use in decks. But I do not know if it's been re-banned or unbanned. I don't fully remember. But right after this deck, you get yourself the Ultra Rare. The reveal of the ice barrier, beautiful. Yo! Oh my god, another girl, anime girl card, I'm happy. We have the speaker of the ice barriers, beautiful. We got um, Zuijin of the ice barrier. Uh, wings over the ice barrier, okay, a lot of ice barrier cards. There it is, the new one, Trishula, Zero Dragon of the ice barrier. Trishula, the original one, was the one that got banned. This one probably might be next that will fully get banned if, if it get, if it's too strong. Get in there! Hidden Arsenal number two in the house. Or is it three? It's one of the two. We got Duilio, the Tiger King of the Ice Barrier. Let's freaking go! I am so happy that we printed it. And there's Bionic, the Dragon of the Ice Barrier. We got Gungir, the Dragon of the Ice Barrier. And there it is, Trishula, the Dragon of the Ice Barrier. This is the one that people were freaking out about when Hidden Arsenal 4 got released because it was that powerful. And sadly, when the pack got released, it got instantly banned. So the price of this card went plummeted down to the ground. But thankfully, now it's been unbanned, it might be a bit more pricey now. And that's all the holographics, so let me just go ahead and sleeve these bad boys up. I'm sure I've shown you the price already as they were going through, because that's what I am like. And like I said though, people, how have you guys been anyhow throughout the months? Have you guys been having a lovely summer? Have you guys been doing something nice, even though we're still in the little bit of the pandemic? A little bit. Uh, it's on and off right at this moment, so hopefully everything will get back to the way it was um, two years ago, so if anybody is not been well or anything, hopefully you all get well soon. If there's anything that's happened to you and it's been awesome, congratulations. If something bad happened to you, always keep your chin up. Everything will always get better in the near future. So right there, so how many holographics was in this in this deck? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine holographics. That is insane. 
That's awesome. So let's have a look at the commons though. We have General Wien the Ice Barrier. We have Hex Spirit. I'm not going to say the Ice Barrier of all time. Um, we've got Blizzard Defender. We got the Caramancer. That looks nice. We got Prior. We got Defender. We got the Warlock. The Spellbreaker. The Stargist. The Dance Princess. The Daz Sojo. We got General. Oh, there's another card that used to be expensive back in the day as well. <laughs> this card was was always setting you off with a bit of a pretty penny back in the day when it got released. It was that good. Um, we got the General. We got Medium or Medium. We got General Jantella. General Garnard. And then we got yourself Genx Controller, Genx Undyne, Aqua Spirit, Deep Frog, um, we got a Toadin, we got Fishborg Launcher, we got the Elemental Lord, beautiful card, Silent Angular, we got Freezing Chains of the Ice Barrier, Magical Triangle of the Barrier, Medallion of the Barrier, Mirror of the Alia, Salvage, a great card, great spell. We got Surface, another good spell card for your Fish and Sea Serpents and your Aquas. Where are thou? That is good. Good card. We got ourselves the Appointer of the Red Lotus. Sweet. Not seen that card before. Pay 2,000 life points to reveal your entire hand. Look at your opponent's hand and banish one card from their hand until the opponent's next end phase. That is good. Fiendish Chain. Essiban. Uh, Mind Drain. Great card. I think they changed the artwork as well, which is cool. Heavy Storm Duster. Crackdown. Terror. Trishula, sweet, finally a card that we use, and you get yourself your special thing. So if you guys really want to use that little tiny code right there, you can go ahead and use it for Duel Links. If you guys have not played this game yet, please do, it's an amazing game. It's on the Nintendo Switch and also on the PlayStation 4. I'm not 100% sure if it's on Xbox though. And that is the new set, Blazing Vortex. Scan here to learn more. And there's the structure deck. Now you may be thinking, what are my thoughts with this deck? This deck is insane by the look of it. Some of the cards I do remember back in the old days of 5Ds, but my god, the one I'm very happy with is definitely the Speaker of the Ice Barrier, the new Trishula, and of course the Tiger King as well coming back into the game. The rest of them I'm extremely happy too. Is this deck going to be a massive threat in the future? It could be, unless they get debunked and some cards get banned. But at this moment in time, this deck is 100% a threat to the game. If you guys want to be a very, very strong duelist, I'd encourage you to get this deck. This deck is absolutely worth it. So, if you have your own opinion, please leave it in the comment down below. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe, comment down below, and also check out Card Empire, the place to meet in Manchester, Stockport, and Liverpool. With that being said, the people I'm sleeping will see you guys for subscribing, and I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! Wow, I am so happy the Trishlers are back in the game. Is it time for me to come out of retirement? Let's hope and wait in the near future. I like getting these, these are nice. I don't have a clue what the values are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Ah! Ah! Oh, 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 oh my God!